g'day guys. You know, camping's all about relaxing and really enjoying the great outdoors. And the Dingo Forward Fold from Scamper Campers is one of those models that really facilitates that. It's comfortable, it's capable, and most of all, it's priced well. Let's go and take a closer look. One of the major benefits of the Forward Fold design is you don't need much space to set up. It also allows you to have a few extra luxuries inside with the great internal living space. On the inside of the Dingo, things couldn't get more comfortable. You've got plenty of room, you've even got a nice comfortable lounge. And you've even got a queen size bed. If you want an extra bed, this right here converts into another one as well. The kitchen side of things is really impressive. There's heaps of room, everything's conveniently located, and you'll find the massive fridge slot is big enough to handle up to a 95 litre Waco fridge. The kitchen's stainless steel, and I've got to tell you, it really does work well. There's a bunch of little things with this kitchen that really does make it a pleasure to use. Little things like lockable latches on the drawers. It's got the quality three burner Dometic stove. It's even got a full slide out little bench space there. How good's that? When it comes to the luxury side of things, the Dingo really does have absolutely everything you'll need. Things like a 160 watt portable solar panel and a gas hot water system. It's even got a 150 litre stainless steel water tank. How good's that? In terms of off-road ability, there's not many places this camper trailer won't go. It's got more ground clearance than most four-wheel drives, full independent trail and arm suspension, it's even got full mud terrain tyres. The Dingo Forward Fold really is the complete package. It's got absolutely everything you need to be comfortable in the bush, and priced at just $17,000, it's a bloody hard value to beat. This is the progression of what's going on in the market, particularly with imported campers. They've come up with great ideas, they've been here quite a few years now, and the quality of the product is just getting better and better all the time. This is an easy to use camper with quality fittings, hinges, and it's a sensible arrangement of quality features into it as well. For the money, only $17,000, this one will do me. There's a whole lot of little features, little extras that make the difference between a good camper and a, and a less well presented camper. You've got a great McHitch, 360 degree uh, off-road hitch, uh, an ARC heavy duty jockey wheel, great jockey wheel. On the front, there's uh, two nine kilo gas bottles, two uh, 20 litre jerry cans. There's a hose fitting, you can plumb straight into the uh, water system and you can hook straight into an instant gas hot water system which you can hang off the front of the camper for your shower tent right next door. It all works in together as a very well presented and packaged little deal. What I liked about the Dingo was all the livability inside. There's, there's lots of room inside, big queen size bed, they've got a little table set up. And what you, I like about this one, it's got adjustable legs, so you don't have to have your knees around your ears while you're sitting in there playing your game of cards. You actually sit there, do some work, be really comfortable while you're doing it, and that folds down to a double bed. So there's lots of room in there for the family. There's a lot of campers of this style that are quite hard to assemble. This one's easy to put up, and they've also learnt by going to a good quality canvas structure over the top with minimal poles. It's a lot easier than they used to be. The problem with a lot of camper trailers is they look really tough on the outside. You open them up and it looks like a 1980s Chinese restaurant. The Scamper Camper is actually pretty solid inside. All the MDF cabinetry you normally find has all been replaced by metal boxes, so it's just as tough inside as out. I quite like the suspension, independent trailing arm, uh, the chassis is tough, 100 by 50 by 4 mil. Draw bar goes all the way through to the uh, back of the bodywork so that it's nice and tough. Something a great place for that suspension to be hung from. Dual shock absorbers, it's a really good camper. It's pretty well suitable for anyone that's uh, aiming to go anywhere in sort of sandy or muddy conditions, um, you know, small families, two kids max, couples with a seating area, that sort of arrangement.